てすがるやがれAll right, what is going on, guys? Pop Bowls back again, coming at you with a showcase on the new arena based Grim Jow.、Uh, keep in mind that he is not actually labeled as like arena version or anything, so it's nothing really too crazy. And he is in the premium pool. But、uh, yeah, so let's just get right into it. Now, this Grim Jow is actually pretty damn beefy. I feel like Caleb tried to、uh, keep in mind that this character, even though he wasn't released at the quote unquote end of the month or mid month, this character did get Havoc 20%.、Uh, so it's very clear what Caleb's trying to do. They're trying to get that w o p So, he is in a wrong card spot with a Soul Reaper Killer, another Soul Reaper Killer for power. However, keep in mind that he is one of the few、uh, a wrong card slash a spotters that actually does have a Soul Reaper Killer and is actually、uh, quote unquote meta. Like, he's actually really good.、Uh, so, going into it, he is mainly meant for arena, but we'll do、uh, the PVE as well as an arena showcase just so that we can fool around there. He is arena level 7, so we do get access to the long stride as well as the increased special move uses.、Uh, on top of that, he is.、Uh, Uh, also, rank I think he said he's also rank six, which means that we'll get access to all the strong attack recharge links that we can use, which is kind of dope.、Uh, on top of that, yeah, Ooh, look at all the strong attack recharge, me g u s t o All right, <clears throat> so going back into the regular showcase, level 10 SP,、uh, he is a soul trait with strong attack damage. Keep in mind that strong attack damage links actually get translated into strong attack recharge links in Arena. So, not only is he a good character in Arena, but he's also a good link to be used in Arena. So, he also gets a spiritual pressure plus 90. But him getting strong attack damage as a soul trait isn't really a negative because he was given strong attack recharge built into his skills, which is really, really, really good. So, he has a berserker of 60% when you calculate in his strong attack damage link. He has a bruiser of 40%, devastation 60%, havoc 20%, frenzy, and on top of that, he does have sprinter plus two, long stride. <laughs> um, <laughs> I like how you pick long stride.、Uh, he has long stride in arena as well, and he also has poise. So he has the sprinter plus two, long stride, poise, a weakened defense for his ultimate. So this character is just. He's very, very, very power skilled.、Uh, he also has a weakened immunity if that、uh, at all becomes、uh, necessary. Should, could be good if you're going up against characters like maybe, Toki,、uh, maybe Tokinata. That way his soul bomb doesn't just like immediately nuke you、uh, when you're on defense. And maybe Baragons and. I'm trying to think of like realistic weakened units. Uh, besides, like, fifth anniversary, each guy. I can't really think of anything. But,、uh, yeah. So,、uh, keep in mind that he is an Aronka or Slash Espada, which means that anyone with, like, an Aronka or Espada killer is probably going to hit him really, really, really hard. So,、uh, without further ado, let's just get right into it.、Um, oh, yeah. There is one more thing I want to do.、Uh, click here. And you'll see here that we do have the Teacup, Fortification Pull, and Espada Chair, Byakia, Byakia, and Veruca. And if y'all want to, like, feel bad about him,、uh, about him, like, he has three T sets. Woe is me. And、uh, he does have the teacup. He has one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Did you have five? I thought, I thought there was four. <laughs> I counted four. Oh, that's, so, that's actually kind of sad. All right, so let's just get into IZ and just see what this character can do.、Uh, what's cool is that since he is T15,、um, we'll actually be able to get to fool around with his long stride outside of Arena. But in a r e a but the sprinter plus two long stride in Arena just sounds absolutely nasty. All right,、uh, no allies.、Uh, okay, let's just do that. Ah,、uh, the Grim Jot. Yo, his art looks actually really dope. I like the action style pose that he got. All right, here we go. Okay, one, two, three, four. He is a range character. Yeah, he's a range character too. Now, his first strong attack is the same as. <laughs> he just flies.、Uh, his first strong attack is the same as、uh, a Dark Rukia, where it is a projectile. Third strong attack is going to be the 1170. Second strong attack is going to be the 3000 length beam. So you do have the projectile first strong attack, some pretty good range on that. Obviously, the 3000 length beam. Crazy, crazy range on that. Able to reach from all the way over there. And this character is going to get smacked like a little hooker from all the way over there. Now,、uh, let me see if I can test out the range. This should be enough to hit. Look at that. The range on it is just nasty. 
Okay. That should not trigger. Yeah. Okay. So 1170. Boom. Actually able to hit all the way over there. That is really good. That is really, 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 really good. Ah, oh, his special looks dope. We're not going to be able to see his special in, uh, in Arena. I'm pretty sure that they force you to skip your special. <laughs> which is good. Which is good. I, I, I don't want people playing out their specials, especially when I'm queuing up with randoms, bro. Hopefully I don't get paired up with a bad team. Though I'm not going to lie, it probably will happen. <laughs> so apologies if we lose, but I'll do my best. Click. Soul Reaper Killer. Remember he has weakened defense. So first hit's going to apply weakened defense. Subsequent hits will deal the damage. There it is. 59k on the Rugus. We ended up getting like plus 50% damage. We dealt... 40k on the regular enemies, and then we actually dealt 59k against the rookie. Oh, he looks so cool. All right, so I was actually uh, giving misinformation here, and I want to make sure that I give as accurate information as I possibly can. You'll see here that on one enemy, we hit for 47k, and the one that we didn't crit was actually for the 40k. So when you go into it, you'll see here that the crit on the rookie with the killer and the weakened defense being applied actually hit for 59,000. Uh, 0.7 right so if we do 59,000.7 uh, divided by 47k you'll see here it, it, it equivalates to 27% uh, damage increase which uh, falls in line with the 30% buff that you get when you cause weakened defense to the enemy keep in mind that weakened defense doesn't actually weaken their defense it actually applies a damage buff to you by 30 percent so you get a times 1.3 multiplier uh the 40k over here so if we didn't crit then this would be multiplied by 1.3 like because that's the average and it'll hit for 52k if it's not a crit 59,000 if it is a crit and you'll see here that we actually do hit right here uh let me zoom in you see we'll actually hit right here for 51k and that was because that one was not a critical and yeah <laughs> sorry about that just all right let's back to the video I love Grimjaw. Grimjaw is so dope. I still find it funny that uh, Tite Kubo himself said, Yeah, I just named Grimjaw the way I did because I just thought it sounded cool. <laughs> Jagga Jack. <laughs> it's too good. All right. So, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's test this out. Uh, I feel like I, I, I wish I like hit up one of my friends or something, but um, I'm not going to lie. I feel like inconveniencing people to do co op and stuff kind of. I'm, I'm sorry guys my, my i need free flow when it comes to like these showcases like because i have to do this when i have like free time and i was actually gonna sleep <laughs> i was i was watching a little bit of kuroko no basket for like the second i'm, I'm trying to rewatch it because i want to watch the ova yeah i haven't watched the ova i do love this show though i've just been wanting to rewatch it before i watch the ova so uh, we'll, we'll see what's up all right so we did get into a match relatively quickly that's pretty good this should be fun. Now, the only thing that this character didn't really get is, like, guard break and hit hidden enemies. And I don't, I don't really think he needs the guard break. SP base unit should be fine, as is. I'd like to see how the first strong attack interacts against the enemies. DTX, uh, don't really recognize any... Yo, we got a pretty good team, though, like... Yo, dude, he's smacking, though. Yo, he has some crazy range on him. Oh, crap. And he's clapping, he's clapping the Daddy Ichigo's early. Though, to be fair, oh, right, and we start off with two soul bombs, too. You can see the full range. I love Arena, bro. You can see the full range of that first strong attack, full range of the beam. Very, very good. 
I got two boosts already? Let's go. Clap ass. That should hit behind me. Oh, he was in the middle of the strong attack? Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. We can talk about it. We can talk about it. Should hit the Grimjaw there. Nice. Very, very good. Item box appears. We should be fine. My team needs to start, like, getting some boost, though. Like, I feel like my team's getting scammed right now. Though, to be fair, I got two boxes, I think. Look at that. Oh, bro. Yo, the fact that you can actually, like... I love that you can see the strong attack. I'm sorry. I I'm geeking out, because, like... You don't normally get to see your actual attacks, so, like... Yo, my team is just smacking the hell out of these enemies, bro. The Masaki saved my life! <laughs> the Masaki! Yo, Masaki's broken in the arena, bro. I'm telling you. Oh, crap. I should not have... I should not have done that. I'm just gonna, like, attack... When you're already winning, it's better to not, like, score steal and just continuously uh, pile on on killing just the regular standard mobs. Oh, right, poise. Pretty good. Pretty good. It's nice, nice, nice. Yo, don't score steal it, though. <laughs> don't score steal it, bro. I ain't trying to play this game. Dude, we hit him with, like, 36k. Thank you so much. Thank you guys so much. Y'all y'all were gangsters, bro. Yo, who said that Grimjaw wasn't as good? Yo, dude, I, I saw people saying that Grimjaw wasn't that great in Arena. Bro, th th this is nuts. 3,000 length beam. <laughs> yeah, miss miss me with that. Hit me, hit me with that MVP, bro. <laughs> hit me with the MVP. Well, baby from uh, Squad 6 Casual. Uh, we got uh, Squad 6 Cowboy. Uh, yeah, yeah, well, baby, I'm sorry, bro. I'm doing a showcase, my boy. I ain't even, I ain't even actually Eisen. I appreciate you, though. I appreciate you. You have a great day. And, uh, yeah, I mean, that's uh, pretty much Grim John in a nutshell. He's nuts. Like, I I'll be real with you. He's nuts. He's clearly made for Arena. Um, in P regular PvE, though, he still is an amazing character. The first strong attack, despite being range collision, it is a 60% magnification. does have some range collision on it, which means that it pushes back enemies. So if they don't have poise, you're smacking them up in Arena. And if uh, one thing to note is that this first strong attack is actually still pretty good in regular PvE, as long as the enemies are not a boss in co-op. Uh, so, overall... Uh, what I think about this Grimjaw? Tuh. Well, I, I mean, I was screaming like a little girl like the entire game, so like, <laughs> I'm gonna leave it at that. Y'all guys, grind on catch up here, stay blessed. Like, comment, and subscribe. And if you enjoyed this video, shout out to my boy Aizen once again. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.